Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another match preview. And well, we've all been leading up to this one. Um, Rangers also come to Celtic Park as champions. Um, so, before we get in, guys, please subscribe and like. And obviously, it says up the top there, comment what your prediction is for Sunday. Um, I'll talk a wee bit, obviously, about the pre um, about what's going to happen, you know, what I think is going to happen. I've already talked about a wee bit about that in the latest Celtic Mind podcast video. If you haven't checked that out, go and check that out and come back and watch the preview. This is like a bit more into detail what I think is going to happen and yeah, um, more more like that, more more stuff like that. But here comes the intro first. <laughs> hey guys, after the intro there, um, you know it's the latest, it's the latest Glasgow derby. And for the first time in a decade, Celtic will face a new champion on their home turf as, you know, the latest title winners, Rangers, come to visit. Um, well, literally, Rangers are on a course for an unbeaten Premiership campaign, something Celtic and interim park boss, um, parkhead boss John Kennedy would dearly love to stop. Exe expect fireworks, especially after Rangers' title celebrations do widespread, you know, you know, bre and breaching the lockdown rules in Glasgow. It lead, even lead, led to concerns the game might not go ahead with first minister Nicola Sturgeon criticising the Ibrox club for her lack of leadership as she reviewed whether it would be safe for the derby to go ahead. Both clubs have reinforced the stay at home message to the fans as a result and it is officially going ahead which is a good thing. Um, if we look at the, t you know, what is going to be the team news, you know, following Rangers is um, not um, getting knocked out of the Europa League around the 16 in Slavia Prague. Probably there will be a few changes through the, you know, playing 90 minutes, you know, obviously the red cards don't count for anything really because obviously they're out of Europe. If you look at the league table, we are 20 points behind Rangers, Rangers are the champions. What happened last time, guys? Celtic Rangers have already faced off twice this season with the latter, um, just Rangers coming off twice by the best side, a corner goal and double earned 2 0 victory at Celtic Park in October before Cal McGregor on goal settled the contest in the home side's favour in January's return fixture. Um, you know, it's probably another derby game where, you know, it's just, um, we just, Celtic are just, we're just seeing it the season, we just want a new manager, we just want something next season that will excite us again. Um, you know, my prediction, Celtic are going to be desperate to stop Rangers doing this invincible this season, and beating, um, especially after conceded, uh, like, we're conceding, like, we've, you know, the way we've done this season, that's an absolute joke this season, embarrassment. Um, as I say, form can easily go out the window in these old firm games, but Rangers are not nearly uh, crowned champions for nothing, and as I say, it's, you know, it's just going to... We'll see what happens on Sunday. If Celtic win, it'll be a shrug on the shoulders. It will be a wee bit of joy for Celtic fans and myself for a couple of days or a day or something, just to, you know, celebrate something this season. I know we won the quadruple treble, but... It's not, it's not better, I don't think that was better than winning 10 in a row. I don't know 10 in a row was the main thing, but, um, you know, what can I say? It's it's probably John Kennedy, obviously his first old firm in charge, I mean, in charge of the team as the manager, interim manager. Um, the, the odds for Celtic to win this game are 17 to 10, Rangers 8 to 5, and a draw is 9 to 4. And that's the bets, that's the bookies. Um, you know, most people are obviously expecting Rangers to win. Form goes out the window. I don't know where Rangers, like if they're Slavia Prague, and that game maybe put their their game down a bit. Maybe you know a wee bit of off putting for this game Sunday. But nah, I, I see I see Rangers win. I'm, I, I you know I know as a Celtic fan you would never you never want to see your team lose. But it's just I just feel, I just feel like coming. It's, as I say in the podcast, it's like a movie or a a, a series a TV series you've watched about four or five times and you know it's coming. You're just waiting on it coming like that part of the part of the film, the, the, the TV series. Um, my verdict, um, sadly, is going to be a Rangers win. I think Rangers are going to win two one. Um, I'm ch I changed my prediction from the one one. Um, what I said on the podcast. Um, I had more thought about it, and yeah, it's just more come to reality. I think yeah, Rangers are going to win it more than I think. Um, I would also like to see Celtic. Um, you know, defeat Rangers and not on not being beaten Rangers, because if we can't beat them now, like as I said at the start of the season, 
Um, there's nobody else that I can see beating him. Obviously, Rangers beat him, uh, Celtic beat, uh, beat him in the League Cup, but that doesn't really matter when they've stopped this 10 0 really. You know, alright, they missed out in the Cup, but they didn't miss out in the, the, the what do you call it, the, the title last season. So, um, obviously, we'll see what happens on Sunday. Um, you know, obviously, on Sunday night, I'll do the reaction. Um, hopefully, it's a good reaction, but it's probably not going to be. We'll see what the John, John Kennedy decides to put out, you know, what team. Um, if you look at our last lineup, it was against, I think it was Aberdeen. Was that Aberdeen? I think it was Aberdeen. Yeah, I bet, I'm pretty sure it was Aberdeen. We. No, it was Dundee United. Sorry. Well, Dundee United, we obviously Rangers won the title that day. Um, uh, the starting lineup for Dundee United Celtic was Bain, Brown, Turnbull, Kenny, Christy, Edward, Illuminati, Ayer, McGregor, Welsh, and Laxalt. I do expect James Forrest to be in the starting lineup on Sunday. Maybe he will come into, you know, maybe win as the game. You know, down that right hand side, we've dearly missed him this season, especially, as I say, down that right hand side. Um, you've seen that a couple of weeks ago against Dundee United, even though we didn't win, we did get down that right hand side very well with John Joe Kenny as well. Um, you know, will we see Edward Griffiths start up front, or will we just see Edward up front himself? We'll find out. Um, I do expect Bain to be in the starting lineup. I don't expect Barkas to be in goal. Um, it won't be a shot, but it'll probably, uh, um, we're basically playing for pride now, to be honest. Uh, see out this season. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching the Celtic vs Rangers Derby preview. Can we stop Rangers Invincible season? It will be hard to do so, but... Um, we'll find out guys, please stay safe, stay uh, stay home and yeah, support your team from your home this Sunday. Subscribe, like and I'll see you guys on Sunday for the reaction um, and for the reaction. Till then, till then guys, peace.